Hey, hey, hey. Sharon Hornell from here, also known as Pajama Grandma. Let's talk about all ears today. What does the idiom or expression all ears mean? And what does it have to do with supersizing or growing your business? Now, I have learned, I love this expression, and I don't know about you, but over time, I think that we learn things that work for our businesses and work for our lives, and we apply them to all aspects of our lives, not just to growing our business. And all ears, this expression is one of those. When we think of the expression all ears, we think of giant ears like Dumbo or which is the Snow White, Seven Dwarfs, um, the goofy one with the giant ears. But for some reason, we've associated dumbness or less intelligence with, with big ears, which is ridiculous. It should just be the opposite because... If you've got big ears and are listening, or if you're all ears and you're listening sharply and listening intently or curious, guess what? You have got the makings of greatness and whatever you want. Because the way we find out, the way we tap into opportunity, the way we learn anything is through listening, right? Yeah, we can see and observe things, but by listening and really listening for understanding, I've learned that people will tell us absolutely positively everything we need to know about them if we just listen if we ask questions and if we listen and observe everything we need to know about someone is revealed to us our customers our potential prospects our employees our partners our vendors our government officials our leaders our everything every human being has the ability to see and understand at a much greater level than we realize when we're when we're communicating with someone we don't just hear what they have to say if we're listening intently if we're all ears we're tapping into all different levels of understanding and that can save us a lot of mistakes in terms of getting involved with the wrong people wish i'd known this when i was younger uh, it can save us a lot of wasted time and energy and effort on things that people don't really care about, that they don't really want. It will open up the world of opportunity for us because, like I said, people will tell us everything they need, everything they want, everything desire that they want from our business or from us in terms of helping them solve problems or create better things in their lives. If we just ask them and then listen for the answers. Now, the, the trick with this is we can ask people questions but they won't necessarily know how to describe or tell us what it is that they want. And so we have to be better detectives than that in terms of listening to their responses for understanding and then being the go-between in terms of, okay, this is, they're telling us this is their problem and this is how it's affecting them. Well, we know that they need A, B, and C in order to cure this problem or get rid of this problem, but they don't even know to ask for A, B, and C. They're only asking for X because X is the thing they think that they want the most. It's the result that they want. So we're gonna give them A, B, C, and D plus X, even though they're only asking for X. So it's a little tricky, but by listening and practicing listening and being all ears, it's easy to meet people's needs better than you ever thought possible. And the trick with that is, if you're listening to your customers, if you're listening to your employees, if you're listening to other people, you will see the opportunities first. You will have no competition because the competition isn't listening to their customers. They're not paying attention. Most people, surprise, surprise, are not listening to anyone else but themselves on the planet. And by being a great listener, by being all ears, you set yourself head and shoulders, if not light years ahead of everyone else. So there is no competition. Again, you being you, there's only one of you. You're the only person that can compete with you but listening and being an awesome listener being all ears being curious about other people that will set you on a trajectory for success and for supersizing and growing your business that nobody can touch and only you can compete with you when it comes to that um, so go out today be all ears listen intently just practice just try this today I, I challenge you to try just being all ears and listening today and find, see what you don't hear. It's amazing what you hear and how 
You can learn from everybody you come in contact with if you're willing to be open and listen to them. If you're willing to pay attention to what's going on around you, you will see opportunities everywhere that you can serve your customers better, that you can do a better job for your employees with respect to creating systems and procedures and processes that make everybody's job and life easier and the results that you get more consistent. There's so many ways that listening can benefit us. Again, that's why we have two ears and one mouth. It's for a reason because we learn when we listen, we teach when we speak, right? That's it. Go out, make it an awesome day. Listen today and share in the comments below some aha or something that you hear because we can all learn from one another. Take care. I will, of course, be with you tomorrow. Bye.